Carrie, Carrie Chitwood, Evan Salve, Leah Proto Papadakis. Good morning. I'm here to support fair legalization in California. I'm aware that the ERR report has been submitted, and it's my hope that it be reviewed soon. In October 1996, the California Department of Fish and Game mailed a survey questionnaire to each state wildlife agency in the nation to obtain legal and natural history information regarding domesticated ferrets. All state wildlife agencies, including California, were polled. Twenty-five states have classified the ferret as a domesticated animal, and only two states, one which is California, have, de have domesticated, called them a wild animal. The survey also polled, are ferrets being bred in the wild? No state reported documented breeding by ferrets in the wild. Although the court case Wright versus a Fish and Game Commission, the commission heard evidence that there were problems with feral populations of ferrets in Massachusetts, Washington, and there was also ferrets, wild ferrets living in Placer County, California. This seems to be a direct conflict with the survey conducted by the State of California Department of Fish and Game. The ferret sightings that I am aware of so far have been wild weasels. The DFG seems to base most of its case on the New Zealand 1880s. Where, we, where they released wild ferrets into the ecosystem. This was a little bit strange because they released them to control rabbits. Rabbits were another species, species that was not native to New Zealand. So let's take an example here. We have a mice problem here. We release cats. Sooner or later we have a cat problem. We release dogs. Sooner or later we have a dog problem. We release elephants. What do we do then? Release the mice again? The 200,000 to 500,000 ferrets in California are spayed and neutered, and I'm still trying to figure out how it can be possible to mate and reproduce. The other argument against ferrets in California is that there's no known rabies vaccination, although we do have a USDA-approved rabies vaccination for ferrets, namely the IMRAP-3 by Roan Moreau. There has never been the transmission of rabies from ferret to human reported in the United States. Let me remind you of this quote straight from the CA Gov DFG site. The commissioner's ultimate decisions must reflect not only the biological needs of our fish and wildlife, but also the wishes, needs, and desires of all those who enjoy these resources. I would like to thank the commission for your time. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Chitwood.